Hello, Lindsay Learners. Just uh, going to give you a brief explanation on how to do IXL A1. Uh, before we begin, make sure that you are in the correct grade level. If you are a 10th grader, you should be in 10th grade. If you are a 9th grader, you should be in 9th grade. Okay, and the IXL is A1. Determine the main idea of a passage. Okay, one important tip that I'm always giving with these types of IXLs is make sure you're reading everything on the page because everything on the page can help you in choosing the correct answer. Okay, for example, the title here, Crystal Caves of Mexico, is actually pretty important to figuring out which is the correct answer about the main idea of this passage. Um, because if you read it, and I'm not going to read the whole thing, but I want you to do that. It's not that long. And when you're doing these exercises, make sure you read the whole thing. Because using these two pieces of information, the title and the information in the actual paragraph, it's actually pretty easy to choose the correct answer. Let's look at both. Now, the first choice is specific conditions in the cave of crystals led to the development of the enormous crystal structures found there. The second choice, gigantic crystals in Mexico's cave of crystals were discovered by silver miners who were excavating a tunnel. Now, this is the wrong answer. And how do I know that? Well, this is actually in the paragraph. It talks about the silver miners, so, sorry, silver miners who found the crystals. But is that what the entire paragraph is about? Is that the main idea of the entire paragraph? No. While that's in the first sentence, the rest of the paragraph is about the formation of the crystals. And my other clue, okay, the title of the passage isn't Silver Miners Discover Crystal Caves. That's really all about the caves. So it's more about the caves. The miners are just a minor detail in this paragraph, which is primarily about the cave and the crystals. Okay, the second question on each passage is going to ask you to zero in on one detail. Now, knowing the correct answer is this. And by the way, if you got it wrong, it's okay. The right answer is right up here. And you can still use that correct answer to choose the correct answer to the second question, which is, how does this detail in bold, this one right here, how does it develop this main idea? What is the connection between the two? How does this detail help you better understand this idea here? Well, the idea is that specific conditions in the cave led to the development of the crystals. Is it, what is this doing? Isn't this describing a specific condition? So even before I even get to these answers, I already know it's this one, okay? Because this is telling me what one of those specific conditions were. Now, this did not take me that long to go through this process. It's actually a fairly quick process, but one that you must go through carefully. Okay, if you do that, you will find that you will get through this a lot more quickly than trying to guess your way through it. Please don't do that. It won't work. Do it the right way. You can, and it's not as hard as you think.